what's going on everybody and welcome to Elden Ring Shadow of the Air Tree um I know very little about the lore of this game uh besides what I well the lore of Shadow of the Air Tree uh, from what I know has something to do with uh, Mechla I think he's one of the demigods one of the sons of the original gods and something to do with his journey but other than that I'm not real sure um, my character uh, I'm not the best at this <laughs> at, at, at uh, these types of games so I stacked myself I, this is this character is from my second playthrough which I'm using the bloodhound fang and I have the Malekith armor because the only armor I thought would look cool I mean, there's other armors, but I like this one the most. So this is what I'm using. And if you have any knowledge of this game, you'll know you're at the round table hold. So from what I have seen, or surmised, I should say, we need to go to, where is it? Here. And here's a new NPC. We holler at him, and hopefully that starts our journey. And as I said, I am not the greatest at Souls games, so I do a lot of button mashing, a lot of dodging. I do have a parry weapon, but I suck at parrying. <laughs> and uh, oh, like I said, this is my. Uh, New game plus, so my stats right now, that's what they be, level 249, uh, maxed out vigor, I pretty much maxed out everything, the only thing I'm playing with now is my faith, getting it up to 36, because there's a, there's a spell I like, so I want to be able to use it, and I have to have 36 faith, but I don't even know if that's going to make any, if that's going to matter during this game. I have no clue. So, whatever. Let's talk to this guy. Ah, were you guided or a girl. Here by kindly Mikula. I am Leda. And like you, I was guided by Faith along his honorable path. Touch the withered arm, and you too will be transported to the realm of shadow where Mikula the kind now dwells. My compatriots are there already. Like us, they have heard kindly Mikola's call. If you can find them, they are certain to lend you aid. All right. We got to touch the hand. So, just so you know, even though I'm fully, like, max leveled up as I can get right now, anybody that's played this game before, you get one hit very easily, even with my health that large. So, whatever. Let's touch on it. Yes. Oh. Pull out our lantern. So. Also. I mean. If anybody's ever played. This game. Or any of these games before. There is stuff. Hidden everywhere. So. If you've. Never played. Just. Look around. You'll never know what you will find. There's caves. Little nooks and crannies everywhere. You just gotta be vigilant. When you're in this game. Um, I'm, and I guarantee you. I will have some rage moments. And probably have to uh, maybe end a video early. Because I need a break. But we'll see. Wow. Look at that. I'll tell you what, something about Elden Ring. Their visual art and how they put a game together is freaking beautiful. I mean, look at that. Look at the detail. Oh, there's one of the <clears throat> giant looking things down there in the distance with the fire. That was in the, the preview. Or the ad, I should say. <clears throat> 
So I have a feeling everywhere I see, I have the potential to be able to go. But whatever, let's go over here, touch this grace. Just curious to want to look at. Oh wow, look at the map. Alright, looks like. Possibility of. The map. To be opened up right there. That's normally. What I remember a spot for the map. We pull her. Yep. I'm kind of like super cautious right now because. I'm feeling like something's just going to jump out at me and start pooping on me real quick. Yeah. Oh my god, dude. <clears throat> like I said, something was going to poop on me super fast. And I had to use my Bloodhound finesse super early. I didn't even see him sitting up there. That's crazy. What are these guys? Look like kind of like ghosts or something. Luckily, they're pretty easy. Rod of rod of fruit. Okay. Map found. All right. So new map has blah, blah blah. All right. So we have area down here. I bet you we can probably get to these islands. Doesn't seem like there's an underneath at least just yet. I'm not sure what what I want to do. Follow this path around and go to there. This, like, um, <clears throat> if you're looking for this game to be kind of like a, a walkthrough, tell you how to do it, it's not. 100% not. This is going to be a me exploring my way through. So, you can see it's a rather large map, a lot to do. And the best thing for us to do is pretty much just get into it. So, let's go there. We'll backtrack a little bit. That's where we came from. What is that? Can we get up there? I don't know if we can get up there just yet. I definitely want to get up here for sure, too. All right. <clears throat> We follow the road. What was that? I probably don't really need that yet, but I'm pretty close to leveling up, and I want to level up. I'm not sitting on that many ruins at one time. To be honest, that scared the shit out of me. I 
whatever that was, it just screeched. Are you serious? Log the beast claw? What are you doing coming in here? Oh, I missed. I missed. Fuck, 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 fuck. How am I getting attacked already by stuff like that? Little squirrels. Are we going to be able to go down there too? Maybe not. Oh shit. Arrows are good. What's this stuff? Oh, it's a dog. I hate the dogs. There's a camp over there. I just got the symbol for my thing. Someone in there. I get hit. Yeah, arrow guy. Shooting your arrow at me. I'm wrong with you. Break everything. Get some better flies. Coil, wherever that is. Looked like something to craft with. Well, use FP2 conjure a tiny fire flake. Oh, okay. Actually, since I'm here.
Those things are really good. They gives you like a, a shield. Kind of kind of save you. Oh my god, hit the damn dog. Alright. People trying to play jokes or on hidden walls again. Alright, got something. We can go under. Alright, let's go into this church. All right, now it gives us the ability to call that out. Do we do it? Just to be cautious. All right, we're gonna do it. Just to be cautious. Didn't need it. Oh, we got a new weapon. We'll look at that in a sec. Let's take these guys out. Stop, homie. Uh, Scotch Reef fragments can be found across the realm of shadow. Consume the at sites of grace to bolster your Scotchry blessing. Oh, okay. Three blessings that bolsters the recipient's ability to deal and negate damage, but has no influence outside of the realm of shadows. All right, so we need to find a side of grace for that. Is that it in here? <laughs> I was worried about that. Oh, yeah, the weapon. Is it this? Black Steel Great Hammer. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. What, it, what have we got? What have we got? Scroll sort. I can't remember which one it is. Switch view. So it bolsters in strength and dexterity. Oh, by the way, I uh, I started in my character as a dexterity build, and it worked out fairly well. We got, uh, did it. 43 plus holy, physical, 140. So, it could be pretty, oh, and it can take a, uh, what are they called? I can't remember the name things. My ashes, yeah, it can hold, not an ash. What am I thinking of? Yeah, ashes of war. Yeah, the. Alright, uh, well, in case anybody's wondering, I guess you can see what I'm rocking. Like I said, Malik of Helm, the Bloodhound Fang. I have this shield with, uh, Ashes of War. I think it's Magic Parry. I can't remember. Um, the Claw Mark Seal is, uh, is what I'm using to do whatever magic I have. <clears throat> I got the Green Turtle because it raises my stamina. Uh, maximum... What was this? The Air Tree Favor plus two, which is the best one that I've seen for my HP. It raises HP, stamina, and equipment load. Uh, Taker's Cameo raises source HP, which I like. I get hit a lot, so I need something to restore my HP without me having to really consume a bunch of things. And I'm using the Great Jar uh, because it increases my, uh, my load because I do like to switch between that shield and the blood fingerprint stone which i have that level fully leveled and that fully leveled and i also have an ashes of war on this one as well uh as far as weapons i do like to switch between the bloodhound fang and the sacred relic 
and I don't know if the crystallized people are going or crystallized girls or whatever they're going to be in. So you need something that's special. So I got this guy, and I yeah, fully fully labeled Flame of Art Inferno Crosshair. Really good. I love the other one. It really hurts them a lot when you use that. Um, are you going to disappear? He's probably going to disappear. Yep. Like I said, we're just going to venture. Growl at me? What's wrong with you? He's a growler too. What are you guys hiding up in here? Anything? Am I the uh, one sitting here? You could just hide in here doing nothing. All right, Church of Consolation. Kind of looked through here a little bit. All right, looks like there's a way down right there. There's little tombstones on the side. So, let's just... We'll just go there. I guess we're supposed to do anyway, so that's what we'll do. Scared someone's gonna jump out at me, dude. They kinda did already in the very beginning. Like I knew it was gonna do something like that. What's this? Seems kinda weird there's a little shelf right here. Like this is what I'm talking about. When you play in these games, you see something kind of like oddballish, you gotta go check it out. I haven't found another side of grace. Oh, get those. There we go. That's where we came from. Did these guys fall off the tree, I wonder? What's up here? Spirit of ash can be found across the realm of shadow. Consume this ash at sites of grace to bolster your re revered spirit ash blessing. Spirit ash blessing bolsters both summon spirits and spectral steeds' abilities to deal and negate damage, but has no influence outside of the realm of shadow. Okay. We need to find a side of grace. Even though I know where one is, the very first one we found. But I'd rather at least make it to another one before I look at that stuff. Mm hmm. 
Scorch Ruins. So I have a feeling the dude here has something to do with a lot with like flame, right? Here we go again. A hefty crock put. You guys are coming after me a little, but I don't really care. Oh, except for when they throw shit at me. I don't like that. You motherfucker. Do not throw stuff at me. Great. Oh, we got a cookbook. How do we... Do I need to leave here to go look at cookbooks at the turtle? I might be saying stuff no one really understands. Oh. That's why... If you're watching this and you haven't watched anything as far as how to play the original game you're probably doing it wrong because you're going to get lost there is a turtle a very wise turtle that you go to and if you have cookbooks it will introduce you to spells from them Uh, right now, I have uh, the Blood Flame Blade, my spells. Uh, I like from Armin, so I like, because I like, you can put stuff onto your weapon. And I have some Dragon Breaths. And that's the one I'm trying to get leveled up right now. Oh, fuck, dog. I thought I heard something barking. I'm just killing everybody. I don't know yet. Until I figure shit out. No one's really safe. Give me the ability to call out the thing. Do we call it out? Which is, you know what we need to do. Inventory. Put on my ruin art. Left me up a little. Oh shit. I told you, mother truckers. You're throwing shit at me. Did I miss anything over here? Yep, I did. You gotta look everywhere. I'm telling you now. Got that fur finger. Anything else? I don't like anything else. Um, those little shadows that you see that I'm not fighting, like there was a guy right here on a horse, those are other players, or previous players. And I'm creeping around corners and stuff. Oh, there's another one of those. Another one. Obviously, there's shit out there. I find this. Oh, there's a side of grace right there. Ooh, should we have hit that first? We'll be fine. We'll brave it. We'll brave it. Uh, I'm so nervous. Oh, 
auto butterflies. Nice. Where is this a thing? It is. Blade of Mercy. Is that? Now we got, we got. I think it has something to do with this stuff. Raises attack power after each crit hit. That could be interesting. we can survive this jump. Yep. Red flesh mushroomies. I don't think we can jump up there. Nope. Might have to go back around. Cause at least I, I want to try that door. You know what I mean, Vern? I feel like it's that that if we go that way. Our, our mimic is being shown, or the ability to call him, I should say. Right. Uh, there's something right there. Okay, so we have to find a way to get there. I am... Another problem with when I play these games, I'm a loot whore. I have to find everything. I get upset. So, gotta be a way to get to that. All right? Maybe if we go down right there. All right, so I have to go tw up three times. One more time around. It's kind of like a exploration walkthrough. We're all learning at the same time. No, I could probably could have used my horse and maybe jumped over to it. Oh, but this worked. Beautiful. All right. I don't know if there's anything else. Let's get on our old horsey. And go to the other side of Grace. enough to level up, which we do, Shadow Realm Blessing, alright, let's see, consume 
Scatry for having to bolster. I hope I'm saying that right. Scatry, Scatry blessings. The Scatry blessing bolsters the recipient's abilities to deal and negate damage, but also but has no influence outside. Okay. Close. Use one fra uh, Scatry fragment to empower your blessing. Yes. Powered. And this one consume. Revered spirits ash to bolster your revered spirit ash blessing. Spirit ash blessing bolsters both summon spirits and special sea steeds abilities to deal and negate damage, but has no influence outside the realm of shadow. Okay. So it's kind of like. Was it flash stuff? Yeah. Th those uh, seeds or whatever that we use to increase our flask. I think it has something kind of like that. What? How long? All right. Um. Do we go mess with that? I kind of want to go over here, explore all up there, before we start moving this way. And I definitely want to get up here, so maybe we'll go here, and then we'll call it an episode. Pretty sure there's some more bird people at the thing that attacked me. Don't cry. It'll be okay. It's okay. And there's these sketchy looking birds. Like a damn stone bird. Another one. Oh, I missed. Oh, we got two. Stop flying around. Come down here. This drink. Normally, I, I just roll with it. Since we really don't know, I wonder if there's like uh, uh, there was the Black Knights in the regular one, and was it the Deathbirds that only came out at night, and they sucked. hurt you? Are they kind of like the jellyfish? You leave them alone, they they leave you alone? Kinda? Oh, that's never a good sign. See those, I can't remember what they're called, but if you die, you can be resurrected or come back either at Side of Grace or at one of these. It, does it say what it is? The summoning pool is now functional. 
Summoning pool. Oh shit. Well. We said we we're going to come over here and then end it. Oh. So I really don't know what we're getting into. We're going to go hard. Well, I wonder if it's it. And we're going to go. No. We're going to put this on. And we're going to go in. It's not letting me. Are you kidding me? What are you jumping around on? Shit, shit, shit. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck all of you. Got a great sword, helm, armor. Yeah, give me all your shit. That guy took way too long. You will probably see two fights. I literally did like 30. So, as I said, we will end this episode right here. Um, I look forward to playing the rest of the game. Hopefully it's not as bad as that one. I feel like that was kind of like a crucible night. Or kind of the... Uh, oh, I can't remember what they're called. Uh, these separate like entity like ghost-looking fights in Elden Ring. I can't remember what they're called right now. But the enemies were tougher in those, if you know what I mean. So...
I kind of feel like that's what that was. And as you can see, I'm not the only person who's gotten their butt whooped here. All these blood spots are people that have died. So, um, do me a favor. If you're liking the, the gameplay, leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe. But, until next time, peace!